to be doing Oreo's adoption story. Now, no, I did not go to a pet store or to a shelter to buy her. My friend could no longer keep her. And she is a short-haired Syrian hamster. As you can sort of tell, she's a really pretty blackish-brown color with white. Um, my friend couldn't keep her because she had gotten out and chewed up my friend's carpet. So, my friend begged and begged for me to take her. And I finally caved and said, sure. Because, um, I didn't want her to end up going to some random person on Kijiji or something. So, here she is. Um, she's very calm. Yeah, she's pretty tame. But, yeah. Um, so pretty much I just took her in. Now, my old bin cage was pretty worn out, so I didn't really want to keep her in that. So, I had kept her in a 10 gallon to start. And then I moved her into a 20 gallon tall. And I don't know if I'm going to update from there. Pretty sure I might. But yeah, there's a lot of cage updates I'm going to have to do pretty soon. But yeah, that's her. That's sort of her adoption story. My friend couldn't keep her and I decided that I would take her. Now she was free. My friend didn't charge me anything for her. So I'm thankful for that. But yeah. She's adorable and her, her name's Oreo. And yeah, she's really cute. So she is my fourth hamster. Yeah, so that's sort of her adoption story more into depth than I did in the other video. So yeah, that's Oreo. Hope you enjoyed. We'll see you in my next video, and that's sort of her story. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!